Good morning, shakers and grooves. Welcome to a brand new little um, clip. Uh, don't imagine this one will be too long, but it's all good fun. Uh, and I, look, I really hope you're getting something out of the stuff that I post. Uh, just one, one thing's enough. You don't have to take it all in. And if you do, you do. So it's interesting that I've been working with a range of different people. Um, I don't like to pigeonhole myself with one group of people. So, you know, I work with rugby league guys working on strength and conditioning, and that's one part of the stuff that I do. And then I work with, you know, let's just say older people trying to lose some weight, and then, you know, then I work on some um, people dealing with big changes in their life. So, I guess for me, the one thing that I see that resonates across all of them, and that is trans changeable. Um, stuff that happens across all of them is being present in the state and the place and the experience that you're in. And I'll go into that quickly. And I keep saying it all the time. If you simply are present where you are in what you're doing and how you're being, feeling, acting in that experience, then nothing else matters. And classic, classic example was that we had a, a fairly good session last night with the fellas in the rugby, to, rugby side. And they have a, a tendency to go off track, as they do. And then they, dare I say, they lose their shit. So by simply reminding them that all they have to do is get to the job, be in the present state, and we word it differently for different people, be there, do the job, get it done, be conscious of what you're doing in that and then move on, then it actually all makes sense. And it's interesting that everything else starts to actually fall into place. So all of the stuff that they worry about in between, outside, before, after, actually has no relevancy because they're actually present in what they're actually doing and what they're being asked to do. Now, yeah, I'll change that and I'll put it into, you know, I'm working with an older gentleman who's trying to lose weight. By simply reminding him to be present with his body and be present with who he is and what he's doing in each moment, then all of the stress and all of the crap that happens around the headspace and what am I eating and what am I doing or what am I doing and how am I doing it and da-da-da-da and what the fuck, oh, fuck this diet, I'm out. I'm out ceases to be relevant because he's actually listening to what he needs to do. So really being quite present in who he is and who he is in this space and how that happens. And I think if you sat after you've listened to this and went, oh, okay, let's look at it, look at it in my context. Is there a state or a stage or time in my day where I could simply just be here listen to what I'm doing and go, okay, am I being actually fully present and fully conscious in what I'm doing right here and now? If the answer, and I guarantee you, you're not gonna say, oh yeah, yeah I'm that, yeah, yeah, because if, if you all of a sudden go, oh yeah, yeah, I'm doing it, I'm doing it, I'm doing it, then you're probably not. If you have to think about it and go, oh, okay, well maybe I could look at this, this part of my day, or maybe it's, you know, the mid-afternoon where I'm starting to fall off, or maybe, maybe I'm actually not conscious at all, then, might time just to spend five minutes that's all it takes sometimes five minutes work on the little things okay that's long enough I'm not gonna uh, waffle on anymore look I hope you got something interesting out of that hope you got something new and again happy to take questions happy for you to email me if you want to have a chat about it smile nod embrace life and simply embrace who you are and where you are and what you're doing right here and right now. Because you know what? That's all you have. You don't have yesterday. That's gone. You don't have tomorrow because tomorrow never comes. We all know that stupid stuff. So simply be in this moment, listening to this video, being thankful for who you are, what you have. Because trust me, you're the one creating it. I'm not. Oh, you're the one creating your life. Okay? Go forth and conquer or, or not.